Hello everyone. Today's topic is Converse of Basic Proportionality Theorem. If you haven't seen uh, my previous video on Basic Proportionality Theorem, so you first see that and learn about that, then go for it, then you will understand a uh, better way that how this Converse of Basic Proportionality Theorem works. It is a topic from similarity. Okay, before I start my lesson, I want to tell you that uh, I'm, I'm teaching mathematics online. If you are expecting online classes, you can contact me in my email or in WhatsApp and you can visit my website www.moimath.com. There you can get so many worksheets, so many study material and it's uh, free of cost. You can access it, you can use it for your better learning and study. So let's start our inside topic uh, on converse of basic proportionality theorem. Uh, first you need to know the statement. The statement is if a line divides any two sides of a triangle in the same ratio then the line must be parallel to the third side. So for this case this will be the picture where DE and parallel to BC we need to prove. If they are already in the same ratio means AD and BD, AE and CE they are in the ratio we are going to explain the picture in the next stage. So there's a little delay things. Okay, sorry for the problem. So let's see that how it is working. AE by EC plus one if you add in both side and add those values into like an algebraical or in numericals how you solve it. The same way if you solve it, AE plus EC, if you see check in the picture, AE plus EC is AC and A plus FC as per a construction that is also AC. Now both our numerator are AC, so if we cancel AC in both side, we are going to get EC equal to FC. So from here we can say that the point E, A, e and F coincide on AC that is DF coincide on DE. That means they are the same line. If we have as per our construction we have already have taken that F is another point so DF is parallel to BC. As per assumption so we can see that DE also parallel to BC because they are coincide lines. Hence its converse of basic proportionality theorem proves. So in basic proportionality theorem state that if there is a parallel they will be in proportion Rashi means their sides will be in proportion and converse theorem state that if their sides are in proportion we have to prove that the lines are parallel which is this one. Now we are going to solve one problem based on that. I am taking one problem that is this the diagonal of a quadrilateral ABCD cut at K if AK equals to 2.4 centimeter, KC equals to 1.6 centimeter, BK equals to 1.5 centimeter, KD equals to 1 centimeter, prove that AB parallel to DC. So in the for the solution we need to draw the picture also. So if you draw the picture, picture will be look like that. Where at the next you have to write everything which is given. Now if you follow it up that DK which is KD or KD if you do that by BK which is 1 by 1.5 which is 2 by 3 and CK, CK means KC which is given 1.6 and AK 2.4 if you divide 2 by 3. So in both cases you can see that their ratios are in common proportion. If their ratios are in common proportion so we can say that AB is parallel to CD. S that's all for this one problem only I have shown over here. If you want more problem or more practice on that you can send me an email so I can forward any other link or any other sheet which is available with me. I'll send it to you. You can learn it in better way. Uh, once again I am saying if you are expecting online classes you can contact me freely in this whatsapp number and as well as in this email id or if you have any doubt please comment below. Definitely subscribe this channel for more understanding more learning on mathematics. Thank you.